What's up, everybody? Fatty Maddie back with part 31, I think, of Immortal Unchained. Uh, we got to a new area. Actually, I wonder if I can level these up. These are bare. They haven't leveled any of these. What's the scaling? What's the heavy impact? Attack speed is up 80%. Stamina use is down. It's fire. 42. Let's use these. I'd really like to use those, but I don't have enough finesse. I'd only need two points, but... These actually deal fire damage, and I'm going to upgrade these. Because why not? And, yeah. How many advanced components do I got? I got 40. Okay, yeah, let's go to one more. And while we're at it, we'll upgrade this. Okay, I don't have enough to upgrade another one. But, we're gonna equip these. Because these guys are, uh... I feel like they're frosty boys. And they would like some fire up their butt. Yeah. They feel like frosty boys to me. Really, really enjoying this freaking machine gun, dude. I want a legendary sh auto shotgun now. So, we got a small strong box. Mm, what we got? Okay. Got some cool music going on. Well, look at you, trying to be all fancy. How do you like fire? Yeah, burn, baby. That's right. They definitely don't hit as hard as uh, my frost malls. We got a fire shotgun that we can use. It doesn't have as much ammo though. Alright, I'll just stick with what I got for now. Alright, this time we're just gonna charge in. Oh, we got a sniper up top. Okay, so do not charge in because there's a sniper up top that was killing us too. <sighs> Bunch of rude dudes, man. I want to like just like rush in, man, and I can't. <laughs> Swords do look cool. But the malls are more practical. They actually do their damage like they're supposed to. Okay, I think these are more of a finesse weapon. But they're awesome looking on my back like that. Alright, well let's get rid of this guy's shield. I don't like his shield. Goodbye to your shield there, buddy. And we will not dodge you apparently and not even damage you somehow okay you're being a little cheap with your attacks there dude like what the heck
Alright dude, you're pissing me off. Just freaking die, dude. I'm done. I've used enough healing items on you. I thought I dodged it, but apparently not. <laughs> Alright, well, that guy is just gonna be a cheap. Jerk and sit up there. Kinetic force engine advanced components. So we'll just keep moving. What's down here? Neophyte night hammer. Bit canister large, base component and advanced components. Uh oh. Boss fight. How much of a bet? going back to Viridian, what the heck? The Observatory. Castellian Peacekeeper? Oh, dude. Okay. I don't think this guy's gonna be too much, but we did a lot of damage to him already. I just didn't see the explodey guy come out of nowhere. Pretty sure I can kill this guy. Might as well. I mean, right? He's got my bits, but so now I gotta go. He's just gonna do that stupid thing every time. He does have a reach, though. I need you to do your shield thing again. Get hit while on the ground. Okay, I think his spawning dudes are dead, so it's just me and him now. So he's dead. Right on. Castellian Peacekeeper defeated. That wasn't too bad. That actually pretty easy. Large strong box, six defense cipher, stream decree, bits canister, automated ability control, awareness boost, and advanced scavenger kit. Cool. Uh, that was kind of lame. So it looks like they've started recycling bosses, which I don't really like. And 
continue on until we find another obelisk. We got, oh, I need a chromatic protocol. There was that other boss I ran away from too, so I could go back and fight him. I hear you don't like grenade launchers. How about burning to death? Really? You're not dead yet? I don't know why I let him hit me again. I should have just killed him. Ow! Oh, I'm really out of ammo. Okay, got that guy killed. He's dead. Yeah, these really don't do that much damage at all. What we got? What we got? What do we got? Forlorn Idol, the manipulator. Inheriting his father's mischievous cleverness, Melog has a, a penchant for manipulation. There's an obelisk down. Oh no, that's that portal. Oh, snap! I'm gonna die. No, 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 sir. No, 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 no. Okay. I am out of healing items. That guy's dead. I think I do have a couple syringe, TRM syringes, but I really should save those. Alabaster Hillcaster. Hill carbine. Lots and lots and lots of... Machine guns. Nice, I can just blast those guys down with that. Oh look, a strong box. Support cipher and a basic component or two. What do we got? What do we got? Anything? Oh, we got a bad guy. Dang it, dude. I can do that too. Oh my gosh, I can't get through his shield. Thought I was gonna die there. Hey, there's another armor shrine. Small strong cox. Uh, we got an epic sniper rifle. Increase grenade capacity to three. This is where that guy was shooting us. Heat patch, details, design white, internal AI assistant, and advanced component. Okay, we got a bunch of guys.
Okay, dude, that's annoying. Oh my gosh. Getting stuck on stuff. Whew. A little challenging there. I'm gonna go ahead and use one of these so I can get some. Uh... Oh wow! Ammo back for my. Just... Let's... Okay, okay. Oh dang it, he got me. Reload, come on. I know I keep canceling it by. Uh. Okay. Watch out, another guy. Okay. Got him down. Got some bits. Really could use a shortcut or something. A bit cast canister medium, basic components. This just comes back up. Yep. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and use a syringe. I've come too far to die now, so. Doesn't mean I won't, but. I would prefer not to. I feel like we should be getting to another obelisk pretty soon. We got uh, this guy again, Naro. Pains me this prophetic tide. I want to avert my gaze. I cannot. What once was the crowning jewel is now nothing more than a reminder. What vile being would welcome? Such Don't know, dude. No strength, no knowing can stop the fate. How strange it would be if their effort is what fostered this change. Were we the bearers of this fate, or the instigators? Is it fate or action that dictates such? Is it fate? Okay, you in your loop now? Yep. Memorial. The indu induction of Cathal was applauded by the court as he was welcomed to Apexion as a war hero. He was the first and only Degonite to stand side by side with the Prime. So... Dang it, that looked like an obelisk or something that could be activated and it's not. We gotta keep going. got here. Okay. I need an obelisk. Looks like there's one right here. Nope. Forgotten bits. There is an obelisk right here. Basic component. Okay. Let's look. Level up. Uh, what do we got level up? Expertise again? Or endurance? Should I do endurance? Plus 1.25. I don't feel like I'm getting very much for that anymore. So weapons. Three new ones. We got the Hellcaster, which is energy when it needs something that I'm not going to be able to use, so... Scrap that. That thing again. Oh yeah, that's right, we got this. That looks awesome for a freaking sniper rifle. I'll tell that, say that for it. Oh, we got another launcher? That's right. The night ham Oh, it's a fire one. Oh, dang it. So, compared to this... 
What does it do? Power attack barrage. Silencer, vertical grip, energy use. It uses more. Reload time. It goes up by 2.3 seconds. It's got low recoil. It's got less stability damage, less armor penetration, less damage. But that other one is like really leveled up, so. 233 firing mode burst what does that mean burst I feel like this would be better oh dude Do I have anything? I'm gonna level this up a little bit. Epic. What is the other one I was using? Is it epic too? It is an epic. What's it, what gets upgraded on it? Stability, damage, and damage. What's it gonna hurt, right? 5,000 bits to get it to excellent. Oh, that's, oh that is enough, okay. Okay, now the next one would be Superb, which is what the other one is at, I believe. It's an excellent launcher, it's not a Superb. Okay, so now we can compare. Yeah, it's still not as good, is it? Damage goes up, armor penetration goes up, stability damage goes up, reload time. Dang it, I wasted all that crap on that other one. I mean, I could use it. We can try it. But anyway, guys, we're gonna wrap this video up here. We got to another obelisk, so. We got another door. Looks like we're finally getting somewhere, which is good. Let's just test this real quick. Oh, I don't know, it might be pretty good. I mean, the one saving grace is it's got multiple, like, shots before you have to reload. Where the only other one only had two shots. This one's got a lot more. It's got six, you know. But, I don't know. We'll just use this one. It's better. I mean, all right, guys. Like I said, we're gonna wrap this one up here. I just wanted to test that real quick. Uh, if you haven't liked the video, be sure to like the video if you did. Um, or you can hit that list like button. It doesn't really matter. But subscribe to the channel if you're not. If you're new to the channel. Um, I do want to say thank you to all the people who are actually watching them. It's helping my channel grow a little bit. It's not growing real great, but that's okay. It, I'm still having fun in doing this, and I hope you guys are enjoying it too. 
I'm going to keep pushing video videos out, and uh, as soon as I get this game done, I will be doing more Spider-Man and stuff. It's just, this game is takes a little bit more effort to actually play because it doesn't hold your hand and tell you where to go. And it's all, you got to figure it out yourself. Whereas like Spider-Man and Tomb Raider, you got a basic idea. You're going to go to different objectives throughout, especially Spider-Man. You're going to set a waypoint and go here, go to the follow this waypoint or that point, you know. So you're going to get through it a lot faster, I feel. Um, it's still going to be a large game, but it's just, there's the main story I feel like can be completed pretty quick. So, I've been playing this for about, uh, let's see, probably about 20 hours, I think, now. So, as always, guys, we will see you in the next video. Have a good night.